Hey everyone, how y'all doing? Got a real quick unboxing video for you today. Um, this is something small I bought from Amazon. I actually, I bought it for work, but I thought it was pretty cool. And I thought I'd show it to you. So, let's get this thing open. This knife today is the Orion Solaris. I just got this pretty awesome knife. Button lock. So yeah, I did an unboxing video on this last video, so you can go check that out if you want to see more about this, but I'll be doing a full review on this, you know, after I use it for a while. Yeah, let's check this thing out. Get rid of the bag. So, some more stuff. It's all wrapped up in this plastic. I don't want to ruin anything. So this is actually another hide and drink item. I've got a couple hide and drink products off of Amazon and I really like them. And this is nothing special. This thing cost me like $7.50 or something. But I, thought, I think it'll come in handy. So comes in this little bag, little rawhide string, leather tag, little leather accent right there. Yeah, so I can get this untied, holy moly. <clears throat> Probably a better way of doing that. There we go. Let's open this up. Try to keep this really short and sweet. So, inside, <clears throat> got a little card, number 36, El Cazal. If you don't know, all hide and drink products are made in Guatemala. It's a, you know, a whole community of artists. Um, they make all kinds of stuff, leather products, stuff on wax canvas, you name it. And they're on Amazon. Um, the only thing is, they make limited quantities. And I think all three items that I have are sold out. So, they might come back in stock, or something different might come back in stock. Uh, what else is in here? <clears throat> Guess that's attached for now. But yeah, you get a little swatch that says 101 year warranty expires something 2121. And approve. I can't really read it. But anyways, it's signed. <clears throat> then you get this little keychain, ball chain with a little leather tag, 100% full grain leather, hide and drink, got the owl. So, get this off, and I'll try to explain what this is. So this is a part you go around, hang from your belt. <coughs> And this part, I shouldn't have done that yet. This part you loop through. I gotta figure this thing out. Yeah. You loop this through like that. Pull it through. So, that part goes over your belt. This part, this little loop, and it tightens up, see? Well, what this is, is pretty simple. Anybody could make these, but, like I said, it was 8-something, had a 
little coupon box, so. Well, it's a glove holder is what it is. <clears throat> Put your gloves in there, cinch it down. You got your gloves without stuffing them in your pocket. These are actually my work gloves. I brought them home just to demonstrate this. And this is basically what I'm going to use it for. Now, and you can use it with your winter gloves, any kind of gloves. But yeah, I'm going to pause the video. I'm going to go find my winter gloves, bring them back and show them to you. Okay, so like I was saying, these are my work gloves. One, one kind of gloves that I wear, they're cut resistant and all that. But yeah, instead of putting these things in my back pocket, walking around, losing one, I thought maybe I could hook this over, loop this on my belt, and I can just stuff my gloves right in there and cinch it down. Yeah, there's, you know, a bigger pair. These are my, one pair of my winter gloves. And I don't know. Shut the door. I don't know if these were actually fit in here. <clears throat> here, try one at a time. Yeah, I don't know. Be cool if these would fit without like ripping the thumb off. <laughs> <clears throat> these are pretty pretty um puffy gloves yeah I probably won't do that I probably won't do this that'd be a hassle to get them in but you know a lighter pair of gloves would be a lot better I got a pair of fleece gloves that I usually wear. I don't wear these that much, often, <clears throat> but the gray fleece ones, they'll, they'll definitely fit in there. But yeah, these ones do. And this is what I bought it for, was for work. So I can have my gloves. Now, I do have Another kind of glove holder, but I'd never be able to find it. Uh, wish I had that out to show you guys. <clears throat> but essentially, anyways, the other kind, two plastic like alligator clips you can clip it on your belt loop then you just clip it on the gloves but yeah I thought I'd give this a try like I said <clears throat> with a coupon it was only seven something so you can check it out got hide and drink stamped in there nice looks like a nice snap on it this piece is riveted right through all three pieces to the, the loop. But yeah, I'm going to give this a try tomorrow at work. And, you know, leather, it'll soften up. It's kind of stiff right now, but looks like really good leather. Um, show you real fast. My other two hide and drink items. One was this hide and drink little wax canvas pouch. My little EDC pouch. I got a few things in here. <clears throat> got a little notebook. Got my Victorinex hiker. A pocket pen. Had my little Stanley tape measure. And um, I usually throw in like a uh, Olight I1R2 EOS 
that fits right in there. I have a little EDC kit. So that works pretty good. This one, little leather wallet, front pocket wallet. Got a little organizer on the front. Got the Olight i3 key. And I was carrying my Victorinex Tinker right there. Now I've been carrying this in my pocket using this key dangler. But yeah, this, this is pretty cool. <clears throat> I'm going to try this out. Now, you know, weather's cooling off. I'm wearing pants instead of shorts. But yeah, I can put my cards and money right in that pocket. This thing has YKK zipper. I think this is also yep, YKK. <clears throat> but yeah. Had my my tinker and my red O light. Nice little setup. I mean I have used it. Fits down in the front pocket really nice. Kind of shaped that way. But yeah, there are two items that I really like and I thought I'd give this one a try. Because it was cheap and yeah, I keep losing my gloves. I I take them off. These are brand new, but I take them off, shove them in my back pocket, and when I go to use it, I'm missing one or both, or and it's kind of pain, you know, kind of pain having them bunched up in your back pocket all the time. But yeah, just a real quick video. Just want to show this to you. Um, I think it's pretty cool. Like I said. When I ordered this, <clears throat> there was only one left, and I got the last one. If I can find Amazon links to th these, because I think that's the only place they're sold. Um, if I can find the links to these three products, I'll put them down in the description. If they're not in the description, they're out of stock, not available. But yeah, I mean... You never know what they got. They got a lot of different items on Amazon. And prices vary, you know, from day to day. Sometimes they have a coupon. Sometimes they don't. Sometimes they're already marked down. Sometimes they're not. But yeah, I mean, check check those them out. I think it's a pretty cool company. Like I said, everything's handmade. Basically in a village in Guatemala. Bunch of artisans. They make all this stuff. And they get paid. And the company Hide and Drink. They actually donate money back to, you know, charities in Guatemala. So, yeah. I got three of their items now. Um, I like these two. I'm going to test, try this one out. But yeah, I guess that's it. Just a real quick video. Um, as usual, if you like these videos, hit the like button. Leave a comment down below. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. And until next time, bye.